Thanks. All right, folks, looking outside at the super moon from the downstream casino and resort camera. Here it is real bright. This is the moon. It's pretty bright right now. Now the other direction, of course, you got the sunrise going on, so it's just on the horizon. Give it another half hour and the moon will no longer be visible, but it is super moon right now from the downstream again, casino resort camera here in Springfield. There's some clouds kind of blocking the moon just a bit, but you can still make it out behind the clouds. Still very bright outside and uh, generally clear out there for this morning. There are a few clouds now beginning to move in from the west. And I've been generally looking at a mostly sunny to maybe a partly cloudy day for later today. Right now, temperatures upper 60s, 67 in Springfield, 68 Camden, 66 in Branson, as well as in Harrison, Arkansas. Looking at that future cast again, we might see a, a round of cloud cover move on through, but I still think we'll be partly cloudy skies for today. Tomorrow, I think we'll be partly cloudy as well for your Independence Day. There's going to be a chance of some spotty showers and storms in the area for tomorrow afternoon. Not severe, just a little bit of thunder and lightning at the most, and that'd be about it. But notice this, very isolated, mostly in the east, but they could, can't rely out maybe some showers a little farther to the west for tomorrow afternoon. And then watch what happens when we go into the evening. Kind of go away, which is good news. Most of us, evening plans should be good to go. These storms will go up during the afternoon heating hours and then begin to collapse. And see, as sun gets a little low on the horizon, energy goes away, begin to put away the rain chances for tomorrow evening. So your fireworks forecast then for tomorrow evening be pretty nice. We'll do 80 degrees around 9 p.m. Again, most areas dry. I think those afternoon rain showers should be coming to an end probably after 8 p.m. So mostly 9 p.m. Should be good to go. Still warm though and still fairly humid for your evening hours. 9 p.m. tomorrow. One after the other, we're talking about some rain chances coming our way. Not only for Tuesday, but then for Wednesday, late Wednesday and a Thursday. A cold front's going to come through with a strong system up to our north. This will provide a pretty widespread chance for rain showers and storms for Wednesday night into your Thursday. It's going to kind of stall out, slow down for us there, giving us another round of rain possible Thursday. And then another round of storms moves on through. Looks like for the weekend, Saturday into Sunday. And then guys looking at the uh, long range forecast into next week even. Looks like just more of the same, more rounds of rain showers coming our way. So a very wet start to the month of July with several rounds of rain possible beginning on your Wednesday. Also with Wednesday with the cold front coming through, there could be a risk of a stronger storm or two. Mainly looks like wind and hail uh, hazard right as things stand right now. South winds today, not too bad, 5, 10 miles an hour. Again, a little warm out there, low 90s, 91 in Springfield. Upper 60s overnight tonight, partly cloudy. Spotty chance for rain showers tomorrow afternoon. Wrapping up for the evening. Temperatures tomorrow still fairly warm. 92 degrees here in Springfield. 93 and rain likely in the evening on Wednesday into Thursday. 83 Friday, that's a high temperature there. That'll feel pretty good. Partly cloudy skies. And then guys, more rain into the weekend. Like we said, looks like even more rain going to next week. So a very active weather pattern uh, to say the least. We'll see if we can bank some rain and stay out of any drought conditions here, Tom.